Hi, my name is Lauren Wolsey, and I teach physics and astronomy classes at Grand Rapids Community College. I have been part of the Teaching with Heart program through the Colorado School of Mines, and I have found it really valuable to kind of hone in my interest and focus in improving my classroom in specific targeted ways to help students feel supported um, both uh, in the course content, but also as human beings. Uh, so I've been really interested in figuring out ways to bring compassion into the classroom to be able to convey to students that I care about them as human beings uh, and not just their success in the class. And the Teaching with Heart program gave me lots of things to think about, lots of people to talk to, to brainstorm with, and to compare notes for. Uh, and I really encourage anyone who's thinking about uh, applying for the program to follow through with it. I would say that one of the uh, ways that I made the program most effective for me is to already have in mind my kind of personal values to make sure that the program itself felt aligned with what I knew I wanted to spend time doing. Uh, so I encourage anyone who's thinking about the program to kind of recognize if it is the right fit for you in this moment, if you're ready to put in the kind of work that um, will benefit from being part of this uh, community and will benefit from the conversations and topics that you'll be asked to reflect on and think a lot deeper about. There's a lot of different uh, practices that I do that are in line with the Teaching with Heart practices that are on the website. Uh, and I encourage you to look through that whole list. I think it's a great list. Some of the things that I have done recently as part of kind of looking at the way I show up in the classroom and how students interact with me. Uh, I've added a gratitude reflection practice to the physics courses that I have. They already turn in a reflection sheet that uh, asked them what they found interesting from the most recent uh, readings or assigned videos, what they found most confusing. So that can guide our discussions together and the practice problems that we work through. Um, but in that same space, I have asked them how busy they are on a scale of one to 10 and um, to share with me if they're willing, one thing that they are grateful for from the past couple of days. Uh, and I have so far found that to be really valuable. The last thing I did was to um, share as I was going through this program with my students uh, that I was in this program and that I wanted their feedback on my um, teaching with heart statement. And so the one that I ended up with that I'll um, put up here now is uh, after getting feedback from students on what they found most interesting and engaging, getting feedback from what they saw that I was doing well, anything that they thought I had said in the statement that I didn't really seem to do in the classroom as much as um, I might want, and then I took all of that and improved it. So this is, this is a community effort with my students and myself, and now it goes into all of my future syllabi. So this has been a fantastic program. Uh, I encourage you to explore it and thank you so much to all of the team for putting it together. Thank you.